Hello, welcome to Ken Beer Reviews. Right, I've had this beer a fair while. Um, it was sent to me by Beer 52 in March or something like that, but I've been I've held on for it for a while. Anyway, it's Robinson's Old Tom, and it's yeah with chocolate. So Robinson's there out of Stockport, I believe. Yep, Stockport. Um, which I think is Staffordshire, something like that, sort of west, southwest Midlands. So, right, it's got a bottled on. Well, best before October the fifteenth. You can clearly see it there in yellow. Um, I do like to know when it was actually put in the bottle, really. But so you can you can make that decision when you want to drink it by, rather than them tell you to. But that's just me. Um, Anyway, that's a bottle cap, some kind of cap. Uh, any other information here? It's six percent ABV. Right, let's get this beer out. Let's see what we get. So it's a English strong ale, brewed with chocolate, or maybe chocolate malt, something like that. Nice small bubbles there. It's gone quite, this weather this week's really kind of uh, cold, coldish, loads of rain the last few days. But it's looking fairly murky. Um, Sort of an old sort of just sort of plum colour, something like that, brown, dark mahogany. I think it has one finger head. It's getting aroma. You're certainly getting the smelling the malts in this. Maybe some caramel, toffee. Maybe some uh, chocolate malt. Slightly sweet smelling. It smells nice though. Let's give it a try. Cheers. Oh wow. Oh yeah, you're really picking up on that. Caramel, chocolate. Quite sweet, sweet malts at the front. Mm. Maybe a little bit. It tastes a little bit sort of like fudge. That's the kind of sort of taste you're getting with kind of chocolate sort of mingled in with that. So it's really nice. That's all on the on the front end. And it goes down to this kind of smooth, smooth aftertaste, which you know, you, you, yeah, chocolate, vanilla, maybe a little bit of vanilla. Maybe a slightly, slightly smoky. Maybe a little bit kind of woody. Very slight though. That's, that's underlined very much so the, the obvious chocolate, caramel, um, toffee kind of malts in this. It's quite sweet malts. There's a little bit of bitterness now just starting to creep into this. Really nice. It's the first beer I've ever had, I think, from... Um, I think I might have had their um, the Iron Maiden. I think that was made by Robinsons. It's quite mass produced, and I've had, I've had that before. But I will do it again on 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 this channel. It's not bottle conditioned. Um, I think it's filtered. 
it's a filtered beer there's nothing in there at all so yeah I haven't seen this in the supermarkets although I have seen their um, I can't remember what it's called they've got another beer that I think you can get in Asda I can't remember what it's called at the moment but back to a one finger just off Whitehead nice nice amount of bubbles there the lacing's sliding down with the beer quite well <sighs> really really pleasant it's really drinkable it's got a lovely drinkability of this you wouldn't think this is 6% at all it really not tasting any of that alcohol at all it's really well hidden it's a really well made beer for me um, is there any other information on here uh, they're actually saying it's bitter more where well, they got f four bitter um, spots out of five and then only three sweet personally I think it's the other way around there's a bit more information there if you want to pause it so this was world world's best well yeah world's best ale world beer awards world best ale i don't know whether that that's the saying it's the world's best ale or it was taken part in it um in 2009 so i'd imagine it's taken part in it but i may be wrong um Let's see what it says here. It says Old Tom is a legend amongst beers. First created by the Robinson family in 1899. It has won almost every brewing accolade, including being voted the world's best ale. So there you go. Uh, in this beer, we have blended Old Tom, which is the beer I was on about. Um, which is, you know. Uh, this is Old Tom, but there's there's, um, there's another version of this. Um, there's Old Tom, Old Tom chocolate. I think there's an Old Tom ginger. So um, anyway, um, blended delicious chocolate, made specially made by the renowned chocolatier Simon Dunn. The result is a de deliciously indulgent drink, warming and velvety smooth. Definitely smooth. It's got that kind of, as I say, that smoothness, um, sort of mid, sort of, yeah, mid palate to, towards the end. Very smooth though, really nice beer. Not drinking like a 6% at all, 4% if you're lucky. You, you know, I could drink this all right in front of you. Um, as for a rating, uh, one more taste. That's nice. I'm going to give that. I'm going to give that an eight out of ten today. Um, quite an impressive beer. I really like it. It's really tasty. Um, it's got your all of everything I've already mentioned. Give it a try. Um, I haven't seen it in supermarkets at all. You know, it could be in your local supermarket. Just because it's not in mine. You're not supermarkets are like some beers you can get other places. I can get beers here that you wouldn't get and vice versa so um, check your Asda out because I have seen another version of this old Tom in there so this could be there or just or whatever um, I'm trying to think um, Waitrose is probably a good bet I haven't checked my local Waitrose um, but they do a nice they're, I think they're probably one of the better supermarkets for real ale to be honest with you um, and close, closely followed by Sainsbury's. I think they're the two best. But um, anyway, yeah, check them out. Robinson's Old Tom with chocolate, six percent English Ale. Cheers for now. <laughs>